We want you to be successful in the ADL program, and a lot of that success will be impacted by how well you can access the information in Blackboard. And so all of our courses are set up in the, in the same way where we've got, you know, this type of a dialogue, this interface, and until Blackboard changes, this is going to be the view you have. Um, we've got a start here section that <clears throat> uh, you can fill out the attendance verification. You've got an introduction section. You can look at the intro video. There's all the key information that we want you to take a look at. Um, it's very important that you review these resources. Um, in this section is um, a folder that has Getting Started with Blackboard where you can actually look at some details about how Blackboard works um, and submitting an assignment in Blackboard. So this, this is going to be quite helpful. So it's really important for you to take advantage of these resources that are available. Now, most, if not most, but all of the course content is found in the Classroom or Modules section. This is where you're going to go to find information on the assignments and the assignment instructions and um, all that we're asking you to do as well as the readings the videos that we you want to look we want you to look at as well as access to the discussions you can also access the discussions through the discussions tab but this the, this modular perspective is the way that the course is set up and so you'll see that we've got weeks one through three two to six three to seven all of our courses are set up in a way where the, the weeks overlap. That's just the nature of what you're going to be doing. We, even though we set this up linearly, we encourage you to take a look at all of the weeks. Take a look at the final week because in that final week, everything you're doing leading up to this final week, you're going to actually have to present in a compilation post in this final week. And so it's really going to be important to take a look at what you're working towards because um, in other courses, um, there's always a bigger project you're working towards. In this innovation course, 5305, you're building your innovation plan. And your innovation plan is, is posted and shared in this final week. So keep that in mind. Always look at the entire um, list of course modules. Look at each of the assignments to understand how all the pieces fit. Don't just assume that things follow a linear fashion. Well, they do in the sense that you know, we're constricted by space and time and we do work through things linearly, but it's also important that you take a look at what you're going to be look, uh, submitting at the end. So keep that in mind. This is going to be quite important. Now I'm going to show you how to access the assignment instructions in one of the modules, and this will be the same in all modules. And uh, with the latest update in Blackboard, this is changed somewhat um, and it's actually changed in the last couple of months even once again and so I'm creating yet another video to point this out. So <clears throat> the big assignment in uh, in uh, 5305 is your innovation plan and that starts out with something called the innovation proposal. You also have a contribution learning community assignment here as well and this is where you, where you submit that. So when you go into this particular section you'll notice that this dialog box pops up and I've been in here before because I'm looking at a student's view and if I hadn't been in here before it would say start attempt one. Guess what? You click on start attempt one or continue attempt one and when you click on that you'll see that the actual assignment instructions pop up. Okay, You can read through here, take a look at everything that needs to be done. You can find the um, uh, link to the uh, Google Doc submission, I believe, is here as well. There it is. So to submit your innovation um, proposal ideas through a Google form here, um, you'd use that. So all the assignment instructions are here. You don't submit because you're not actually submitting something. To simply get out of this and move on, you simply close this down and go on to the next section. Okay, so to see all the assignment instructions, like the contributions to the learning community, same thing. You click on it. Um, it now here it says start attempt because I haven't been in here before. I click on start attempt and there you go. There's the assignment instructions. This is a quirk with the latest version of Blackboard and, and I wish it was simply displaying everything. In the instructor view, the assignment instructions are displayed without having to click on these buttons. So um, I'm touching base with the folks in IT and also looking at you know the Blackboard resources to see if there's an easier way to do this. So up until I can fix this, this is what you're going to have to do to be able to access the assignments. When you're finished viewing all the assignment instructions, you then would simply click the X, close this window down and you keep on going. So hopefully you'll find these instructions helpful. Uh, so to access the instructions one, one last time, go into the innovation proposal, it says continue to attempt one, click on that, and you'll see that the assignment instructions will pop up. Hope this helps.